and we reduce the lo loss in the transmission and losses in transmission and distribution. I visualize an investment of nearly 250 billion dollars in this sector in the next four or five years. At least 100 billion coming in in the renewable space, another 50 billion coming in into transmission and distribution, where we are gradually moving at creating a national grid where power can seamlessly flow. And we don't have a situation where Chhattisgarh has a thousand megawatts. They are desperate to sell. Their states in South India, their states in Northern India are desperate to buy. And we have the kind of situation that we faced in Delhi last year, where we didn't have enough transmission lines to bring power into Delhi. Madhur Bajaj, Bajaj Auto. We were very. I would still urge uh, any uh, nuclear experts in the room or who hear this that we are still looking at hearing what is the life cycle cost of nuclear energy. I have said this on more than one occasion in public forums, in private discussions with uh, visiting teams, but I have yet to get a, neck, a, a real feel of what would be a life cycle cost right up to decommissioning. 